Guys, I'm gonna show you how to do your firmware update and install scripts onto your Krona Zen and activate them in today's video. It's gonna be an extremely simple video. I'm gonna go over all types of scripts, the ones from the library, the game packs, and the paid VIP scripts. Now guys, if you haven't joined my VIP, you guys can see, man, we're the biggest channel when it comes to the Krona Zen. Shout out to all my 60,000 subscribers and my 10,000 VIP subscribers on my channel, man. We help people every single day set up their Zen and give them the best scripts. If you guys wanna join that, first link in the description. No one has regretted joining it, guys. We have the best scripts in there. So look, first things first, you're gonna grab your Krona Zen. We're first gonna do the firmware update. Before downloading scripts, before doing anything, we're gonna wanna come over here and click download, all right? This is the Zen Studios. This will also have the firmware update tool. So you're gonna click download right here and it's gonna pop up right over here, okay? You're gonna click Zen Studio setup, just like that, and click yes. You're gonna click next and just allow everything. You're gonna agree and you're gonna install. And now I got an error because Zen Studio is open. Now I'm gonna retry. And it's gonna be good. Once you're finished, guys, you open up Zen Studios, okay? And pay attention closely here. So you're gonna open up Zen Studios. And as soon as you open it up, guys, don't plug your Zen in. So let me actually, so as you guys can see, look, Krona Zen not found, okay? I don't know if you guys can see this clearly. Krona Zen not found. I didn't plug my Zen in at all. You're gonna click open online update tool, all right? Now, what you're gonna wanna do, let me go on full screen camera. You're gonna wanna grab one of these cables that come with your Krona Zen. It's a type C cable, okay? Before plugging it into the top, you're gonna wanna hold this blue button on the back. So you're gonna press and hold it down. While you're holding it, you're gonna plug it into the top, okay? This cable is plugged into my laptop. I'm gonna come back over on the PC camera and let's do it guys. So look, press and hold the button, plug it at the top and keep holding the button. Keep holding the button, keep holding it. Your Krona Zen should show up. If it doesn't show up, click connect, okay? And upgrade it to the latest firmware, just like that. Let's wait for it to install. That's done. We can unplug it from the top now and let's come back into Zen Studios. And what we're gonna wanna do, let's make, let's click okay, full screen it. And then we're gonna plug in the Zen on the right side, okay? When the library shows up and the programmer tab is is click, clickable, you're good to go, okay? Now I'm gonna go have a head over to my device and I'm gonna hit a factory reset. I always do this after doing a firmware update. I don't know why, man. This is something that I've always been doing and I recommend everybody does it. It's good to factory reset your Zen every now and then, especially if it's new. I, I don't know why, I just always do it. it. It's given me a lot better results. Now, this is what we're gonna do. I'll show you guys how to put on a script from this library, which guys do not use. These scripts are garbage. Garbage. Um, I'm just gonna just put it on just because sometimes people want to try them out. Um, I'll just put this one. So look, if you want to put any of these scripts on, you can press this right here. It's gonna come over to the compiler. Okay. Next, I'm gonna show you guys how to add. Next, I'm gonna show you guys how to add scripts from the VIP Discord. So you're gonna literally find the script you want, click download, and then you're gonna come back into Zen Studios. You're gonna come at the top and click File, Open, and then find the script in your Downloads folder right over here, just like this, and open it up. Okay. So now we have two scripts over here. Last but not least, guys, I'm gonna show you guys how to add scripts from the Programmer tab. These are made by Zen Studios. Always click newest and you guys can see we have the military shooter and we can click and drag this into an empty slot okay then you click close window and then guys come over here right under the zen logo click this little thing right here and you guys will see the two scripts show up okay this one is the vip one and this one is the library one guys i don't recommend library scripts they're really not up to date a lot of people just take old ones and just post them on there they're not very good man the best ones are the ones for programmer and the ones for my vip okay from here guys you're going to want to click program device and that's how you save the script onto your device now wait for it to say complete and then we'll go on to the next step success perfect now guys the next step unplug the right side cable okay you don't need to have the right side cable while you're gaming if you're gonna game you plug it in on the top okay now to select the script you want to press this button right over here you'll see military zone eclipse and then the other game, uh, the other script. I don't know what that is. The one I recommend, guys, the number one script out right now is the Eclipse. It's literally the best for all shooting games, Fortnite, Apex, COD, Battlefield. It's so advanced, guys. And then obviously, you want to connect your controller to the left side. But I'm not going over script setup and I'm just showing you how to add your scripts onto your Zen, connect it to your console, and start gaming, okay? If you're lost at any point, man, comment down below. And if you guys want to know how to connect it to your console, check down below for the console setups, okay? I go in-depth, how to connect to your console, connect the controller, start using the scripts and start beaming. Okay. So all for me guys, I'll see you all in the next video.